Hi guys and welcome to another prop tutorial video. So today it's going to be a little uh, different. It's not going to be Doctor Who related because um, I'm gathering there's going to be a few people out there who aren't just Doctor Who fans. There'll be fans of other programs and films and things like that. Um, so one of the things I've made today um, is this. Um, a replica Harry Potter wand. Um, and this is a really cheap really simple prop to make um, and took me about an hour so basically it's a piece of dowel that runs all the way through the middle um, it's 11 inches long um, as I looked up on the internet how long um, the original replica was there's a, a website a link which I'll put in the description um, of how long each different wand is and the different designs um, so that dowel runs up all the middle and then uh, the end here is made from mod rock and you can see that it's sort of rigid and bumped um, and all it is is it's two different colours of paint and then it's covered up in PVA glue so really simple really sort of lightweight prop and as you can see it looks quite good in the hand um, so yeah I mean if you wanted to I mean I did think about it while I was building it uh, obviously there is the toy version that has the light in it um, so if you wanted to you may well be able to you know mold um, over some metal tubing that's hollow um, and have this as a case at the bottom but that I would say is quite a high skilled um, bit of problem making uh, to do so it depends on your skill level um, so it may well just be best to go and buy the toy version of this um, but I mean, the mod rock is the best thing I've found, um, and to, to sort of make this sort of end of sort of handle, uh, as it's meant to be sort of at the end of a sort of twig, it's been cleaned up. So yeah, that's sort of I'm quite happy with that. Um, and the second one, uh, I don't know how this is going to go on screen, um, but this is the second one, um, which as you can see. Um, it's the hoverboard from Back to the Future. So this um, is another simple prop, and this is made from cardboard and aeroply, which aeroply is a little bit expensive. Um, but depending on what you use, you may well be able to use MDF, uh, the thin MDF in layers. Um, and you'll notice that the end of this has a slight curve on it. So it's not flat, it comes up. As you can see, I mean, there's just a piece of wood here, and this circular bit at the top. Um, all the decals are just painted and drawn on, apart from these Mattel stickers, which are just printed out and stuck on there. There's a hole here um, for a, a pole to go in, if I had it. And then if you flip it over, um, there's two, I mean, these, you could um, quite easily just get some plastic bowls and spray them up silver uh, that's these these bits are just pieces of wood that have cut to the shape that they are on the, the original um, but these these bits of plastic were vacuum formed um, so that's how I got those um, so yeah it's, it's a pretty simple simple little prop it's quite sturdy I, I personally wouldn't stand on it um, but I made it so that if I ever did do uh, a back to the future cosplay that I, it would be light enough um, to sort of carry around uh, the convention because you know it's, it's quite a length um, and you don't want to be sort of carrying around something that's really heavy but this is it's it's sturdy enough um, but light enough um, to sort of look the part um, so yeah it's it was a matter of reference imaging um, and you'll, I don't know if your camera can pick it up but there is slight um, silver lines across it um, as per the original um, and that's the same on the back as well but there you go it actually shows up better on the back than what does the front um, so yeah as I say it's, it's a pretty simple prop it's nice and lightweight um, again as I said in my cos how to, uh, accessories for cosplay for Doctor Who um, you know it's, it's always good to have um, something to use um, to take around with you at an event because it gains interest people want to talk to you people want to take photos etc so it's, it's a real nice way in which to get in sort of in, integrated and talking to people 
about their interests and what they're into and about cosplay and costumes. So yeah, I mean they're two just simple little props um, that I've made. Um, so yeah, that's uh, that's what they are. And hopefully um, that video is coming. This video is coming helpful. Uh, if you can make your own. Um, so thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.